CNN host Don Lemon has expressed shock about Meghan Markle's admitting that she only recently started to understand what it's like to be a black woman. On Wednesday, the 31st of August, Lemon chatted with fellow hosts Brianna Keeler and John Berman about his thoughts on the second episode of the Duchess of Sussex's Spotify podcast Archetypes. Despite praising the fact that she addressed colorism, he also said it was essential to acknowledge that she was speaking on the topic from a position of privilege, given that she did not have to deal with racism until she married Prince Harry. In some ways, she's saying that she had privilege and so, therefore, it didn't apply to her because it never happened to her. Right? Lemon told the hosts. The Duchess of Sussex's comments came during Tuesdays, the 30th of August, episode with legendary singer Mariah Carey titled Duality of a Diva. Markle, whose estranged father Thomas is white and her mother, Doria, is black, said that when Carey first came on the music scene, she thought, oh my gosh. Someone who looks like me. She's mixed like me. Because we're light-skinned, you are not treated as a black woman. You're not treated as a white woman. You sort of fit in between, she told Carey before adding that more focus was centered around her race when she began to date Prince Harry. Carey replied, but that's an interesting thing, a mixed woman because I always thought it should be okay to say I'm mixed like it should be okay to say that, but people want you to choose. She was a mixed woman. People didn't really know how to react to her. They didn't know if she was black or white, but she didn't get the full black treatment because people weren't sure that she was, you know, black. I think most African Americans probably looked at her and said, oh, I know that's a black woman, but I think the larger culture may not have realized that, he noted. Lemon also noted that it was interesting that Markle and Carey had shared a similar experience, saying that he remembered when the singer came onto the scene in the 1990s. People didn't know what to do with her, he said. Do they market her as a black woman? Do they market her as a mixed woman? Do they or as a white woman? They didn't really know how to do it, he recounted. Lemon further noted that he thought the podcast was eye-opening. And despite commending Markle for going there on the topic, it's shocking that at 30-some years of age, she just now knows what it's like to be a black woman in the US. It's a bit surprising to me, he concluded. Markle shared that it wasn't until after she started dating her now husband, Prince Harry, that she felt her racial identity received focus. And I think for us, it's very different, because we're light-skinned, Markle shared. You're not treated as a black woman. You're not treated as a white woman. You sort of fit in between. Carrie shared with Markle about her own struggles fitting in as a biracial young girl. People want you to choose, Carrie said. They want to put you in a box and categorize you, Carrie added. During the conversation, Markle also referenced an interview with actress Halle Berry, in which Berry mentioned that due to her darker complexion, she had been treated as a black woman, instead of as a biracial woman. The two women also discussed the evolution of the word diva, and how it has changed from positive to negative over the years. Markle's podcast debuted last week with a conversation on the challenges of motherhood with tennis star Serena Williams. The podcast jumped to the number one spot on Spotify's podcast chart and has held the spot since, beating out the Joe Rogan experience.